Hey what's up guys this is Vimal here and welcome back to TR HD in today's video i'm going to show you guys how speaker voice coils are made on hand so let's go find out so guys here i am at a professional speaker repair center now let's see how a speaker voice coil is made first you have to take a high quality heat resistant paper on which the coil is wound then place this paper on a mold which has an exact size of the diameter of the required voice coil this guy over here made a, a winding machine out of a hand drill by modifying it. Now let's start making the coil. First apply resin on the paper. It's a slow drying very hard resin. Now wind the copper wire on the paper as shown in the video. Make sure you are winding the copper wire on the area where you have applied the resin. For different speakers with different specifications, you have to use different gauges of copper wire and also the number of turns differ based on the requirement. In this video, the coil that I am showing you guys is used in an 8 ohms 300 watt speaker. It's a full range speaker which is used in PA systems. The winding of the voice coils is made in different layers guys. So as you can see the layer 1 winding has been done. So after winding the layer 1. He is applying the resin uniformly over it. You can use any kind of thin films to remove the excess resin on the coil winding. Once the resin has been applied, you are ready to go for the layer 2 winding. So now we are ready to go with the layer 2 winding. The layer 2 winding is done in the opposite direction guys as you can see in the video. It is very easy to make this voice coil guys. You can learn by just watching this video. This guy over here is a professional. He is doing it so perfectly. These people over here make about 50 to 100 voice coils every day. That's just insane. So our voice coil is almost done guys and is ready to be used. He is applying resin over it again to give it a final touch up which gives it strength and that glossy look. So this is the final look of our voice coil guys. It has to be left aside for at least 5 hours for the resin to get dried up after which it can be used to make or repair a speaker. He wound another coil at the opposite end of the first coil so that when you cut it from the center using a blade you get two different voice coils from a single paper. That's just awesome guys. That's how speaker voice coils are made. I had an amazing time watching and learning about it. I hope you really enjoyed the video. Thanks guys for watching my video. Hit the thumbs up button if you liked it. Subscribe and stay tuned to my channel for more new awesome videos.